the year 2000, we had to carry an enumeration exercise in Korokocho. That was the first enumeration which was carried out through the SDI uh, family from outside and Mungano. So we had to carry the exercise of the enumeration so that we understand the, the real picture of Korokocho. So when we had the enumeration exercise, <coughs> that enumeration came out with uh, at least even more groups. It came out with even more members, we mobilized more members through that enumeration exercise. We had the information of the, the settlement, how it is, the different, uh, the different zones, how they are, how they are subdivided, the number of people staying, the number of structures and so forth, the, the services that are within. So we, are, we, we managed to capture all this. By that time is when we even managed to get some few members that in the, in the, within a period of time, these people became the leaders of Mungano. And that was the, the late Benson Osomba. He was mobilized within that enumeration exercise. And he was one of the enumerators. Osumba Benson, he was uh, somebody very much polite. By then, he was just from school. When we, we got we, we, we got hold of him, and we told him, you know, this, this enumeration is done with somebody who is at, at least who, who can uh, uh, write and read. So uh, he was having that opportunity of getting the exercise. But he was very much afraid because those who are uh, doing the exercise were a bit older people. So he was somebody who was young, but had a huge, a huge body with a very big voice, but he was not talking too much. <laughs> when we were doing those kind of advocacy, we were just doing them verbally. And when we tell them we are the one who are staying here, so many people are staying here, they could ask us how many people. We could not answer that question. And we, when we were asked that question, we started looking at one another. So it was a very difficult situation. Then we had to start with the enumeration. And that's why we did it in Korokocho. We managed in Korokocho, we managed to, to challenge the government about Korokocho. And even at the moment, the Korokocho upgrading is almost, is, is, has started. But it is good. They are just using what, what, what the Mungano did or the exercise of enumeration that Mungano did. After doing the enumeration of Korokocha, I, be, uh, I became the, uh, one of the enumeration team leaders of the, of the federation. Because I was, very, uh, I was uh, at least good at uh, doing the, the, the enumeration exercise. So we had a team that had to, to work on, on enumeration as a, for the federation. And the, the first enumeration that we did perfectly without any doubt that we know, now we, now we understand the enumeration was in, um, in the year 2002. We did it in Dagoreti. We had to do it the whole of Dagoreti. From there is whereby we had to introduce enumeration in, in Uganda. By that time is when we introduced even the Federation movement in Uganda. We are the ones who introduced the Federation in Uganda, whereby they are now doing it very well. And after that, the, the, the exercise of enumeration, because we were seeing that it is a tool that gives the real picture of the, of the, of the, of the, village, of the settlement, and the government also recommended as, the, as per the exercise. So we had to expand the, the enumeration exercise to various places. We had to go to Kisumu and do the enumeration in Kisumu. We did every, every, every settlement in Kisumu and the, everything was okay. And the, all those informations of the outcome of the enumeration we are having in our docket of the Federation. And in case of anything, we want to do advocacy, we want to look for what our time now is just to go and do the verification so that we make sure that whatever the information we got there before, is it still there, or the house that was there is demolished, or there was no house there, now there is a house there, so that we verify, and then the, 
the development starts from there. We do not do another, another enumeration unless there is need. After introducing the Federation in Kisumu, we had a, a group that picked up from uh, the, the Sunday group. It was called Oboch, Oboch Savings Scheme. It was only one group because we were doing, uh, uh, we were working together as, a, as, a, as slum dwellers. We had to go and uh, help the Kisumu to mobilize more saving groups, more settlements to join Mungano. So we had done all that and uh, we managed to, to capture five, five settlements that saving groups were started. So when we started all these groups, uh, uh, the, each, 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 each settlement was having one group. So they, had, they picked up, they started a federation, they, uh, they, they started to advocate for the land. By then Kisumu was having a lot of problems of land grabbing and even the threat of evictions. After that, uh, 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 we had to carry the enumeration in Kisumu, and uh, the enumeration in Kisumu made the Kisumu had a very big change because we were working with the city planning of Kisumu, city planner of Kisumu, they were very much cooperative, and uh, when we were doing the, the enumeration, everything we were reporting to them, and they were also coming to, 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 to our meetings. And for those, all those things that we, were, we identified, like water and sanitation, there are some, things, some water that are, are being put in some various slum areas of Kisumu because of those uh, federation members or uh, the enumeration that was carried out. I've been uh, in that enumeration team since that year we did in Korokoch up to now, as the time moved, we have been, uh, we have been doing so many things within that docket of enumeration. Enumeration uh, consists of profiling, enumeration consists of data, data production, we produce the data, enumeration consists of uh, uh, inventory, inventory is uh, more or less uh, making uh, trying to get the history of the place like the way we are now getting the history of the of the Mungano.